what's up you guys it's Sequoia your Silicon Valley tech editor from Black Enterprise and we are at Ford the doctor's office of the future hey Michael how are you doing well doing well good so tell me about Ford yeah so at Ford we're a health membership uh, building the primary care uh, position from the ground up. And one of the important things we try and do is make the user experience, the patient experience that much better. So when you come to Ford, you've already signed up in the app, you've already made an appointment, the doctor knows who you are. When you walk in, you're gonna come over here to the iPad, you sign yourself in, and what we show you is your playlist for the day. It's kind of what the doctor's gonna be working with you about, what labs you're gonna do, what uh, blood work you might have done. So we try and make it very easy and very simple as far as what's going to happen. So we started Ford uh, because Adrian, who's our CEO and one of our co-founders, uh, he was working at Google. He was running a special projects team at Google. Uh, and one of his close relatives actually had a pretty major health scare, had a heart attack. Uh, and so Adrian was spending time in the hospital and saw firsthand kind of what a terrible experience it is, how everything in the healthcare system is set up to be kind of reactive instead of proactive. So we sort of wait for something terrible to happen and then, and then we try to fix it. Um, but no one was really, um, you know, trying to think about how we can make it better as an experience, how to use uh, kind of technology to catch things before they occurred. So you never really, you know, wake up in the morning and think that, oh, I have high cholesterol today or I'm, you know, pre-hypertensive or diabetic or anything like that. Uh, and so we sort of wait too long to catch these things. So we basically wanted to see if you took um, consumer tech people and sort of pointed what they know at healthcare, what could you build? So I'm gonna have you go ahead and step one here. In the heels. Yeah, that's perfectly fine. All right. Gmail. So first thing is gonna do, you can put two fingers right in here. Does it matter which two? Any two fingers. Okay. Push in all the way. And just keep it there and look up. So what this is doing is kind of replacing the nurse coming in and, and doing uh, kind of basic things that normally you would take time or be annoying. This is just happening all at once, checking your heart rate, pulse height, just looking at lung health and, or heart health, your pulse oximetry is looking at lung health, uh, your weight, height, temperature, all that normal stuff that you normally get uh, from a nurse mm. kind of happens all at once here. And what it allows for is actually you keep coming in, we can log this data, create trend lines, see how you're doing over time, rather than just taking these snapshots. Wow. So then do I get all of this data it's to all, my app? or All this data, okay. including all blood labs, all tests, everything's in the app. Uh, we try and be pretty mobile first. Then the app, you can uh, talk to your doctor, you can end up uh, creating schedules, you can even uh, coordinate with specialists, uh, which we'll do on your behalf, actually. So we started about a year ago. Uh, and we started kind of developing the product. Uh, we actually had a warehouse and we, we sort of set up essentially like a test location where we were sort of rapidly prototyping, working with uh, kind of like early members and sort of founding members, um, hired our first couple of physicians and started kind of developing the software, iterating on it, making better, uh, kind of figuring out what worked and what didn't. Uh, and then we sort of launched this first uh, kind of actual live location kind of mid-January a couple months ago. So, have you sit right here in sure. the patient's chair. And so we call this the big screen. On the big screen, uh, the doctor collaborates with you, with your goals, kind of what's been happening in your labs. And the data you see up here is not going to be what you had in the body scanners. It's kind of uh, data to show what would normally be up here. So that's why you don't, definitely don't weigh 215 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> but on here, you can end up working around things like weight loss, okay. back pains, reduced stress, all these different pieces. And all the information that you were looking at, whether it's on the body scanner or working with the blood labs, all this information will show up here as well. So as the doctor is talking to you and you're talking to him or her, all this information is here, so it's very clear to figure out uh, you know, what the blood pressure, heart rate, weight, and we do all these things from whether it's genetic testing, uh, blood testing, all these things show up here. So it's really easy to kind of collaborate on your goals and nice. figure out what's next for you to live a healthy and happy life. And part of that, not only is it having the best doctors, but also the best tech. Part of the best tech is stuff like this. We use this little thing if we're drawing blood, and we're not going to actually draw your blood today, but <laughs> I need that. You, uh, <laughs> roll up your sleeve here. 
So normally, you know, you don't want to get poked with needles all the time. It's kind of an no. annoying experience. Okay. But with this, we actually can use near infrared light and see exactly where your veins are throughout your body. So at that point, there's not going to be multiple poking. Uh, it's just a, a little bit of tech to make the experience that much better. We want to bring better healthcare to everyone. So that means being in you know, the, all the major cities, whether it's New York, LA, and, and so forth. But ultimately, it's about bringing better healthcare to as many people as possible.